am agitated, I am walking through this place and I don't mean to run. How are you doing, lady? I'm going to walk like an agitated person around you. You are my love and trust. You are my person on Pinterest. You are my everything, honey. Hey, everybody. Arch Taco here and she won't stop looking at me. I need an adult! Anyway, in the last episode, we completely finished off Divine Beast Cave and Naroon Village. If you want to take one last good look at it, I'll go ahead and just uh, scroll over where all the houses and uh, other structures are. So uh, hopefully this is of any use to you. Uh, if it helps at all, Divine Beast Cave is over there for a reference. But, um, yeah. In this episode, uh, well, uh, previously we got the world map, so in this episode, we're gonna make our way to Matataki Village. That sounds like a, like a delicious type of sushi. Do you guys like sushi? I love sushi. My favorite, uh, personally, at the uh, Kroger's right by my house, they do it handmade, and they have the best spicy mango sushi. Uh, that was my saliva just going all over the place. So delicious. Holy crap. 10 out of 10 would recommend. Anyway though, I love this music, but it looks like the Dark Genie hit here too. It's looking, uh, it's looking pretty bare, to say the least. <gasps> oh, I was totally expecting the Fairy King. So did we get a Chubster. And, I mean, I, I know, Tone, I know you might feel very, uh, very lost, very hopeless, but you know what? He's the only person around here, so we might as well go talk to him, right? Right. Alright, so if we approach the ladder... Oh lord. This one's heavy. What? Who the... Uh huh, you. You must be the master of the room in the village. I know I'm right. No, hey man, look, this turban. It is good. Uh, you can't lie to me. I think it's a villain face. Oh, the whole tunnel. <laughs> Enough already. I'm so enthusiastic to read your lines. Anyway, though, we get a duel. Woo! I'm excited. Okay. No! Ah, I'm getting. Ah, dang it. Mother poop. Okay, you're not as tough as you look. I want to get all cools, dang it. I am, I am the coolest kid that there ever was. So, uh, as it stands, I need all cools in my life. Anyway, if you mess it up for whatever reason, he just kind of like leaves you alone, even though he calls you a villain and attempts to like smash your face in with a hammer. So we could go up to talk to him, but that won't do anything. So I'm gonna go ahead uh, reset the duel and uh, hopefully get all cools. Because I mean, again, that's just what I am. I'm the coolest kid of them all. Here we go again. <laughs> Tell its face. Oh my god. Okay, can we just get like a picture of that just everywhere? Uh, here. Here, here, and also, uh, over here. Yes, thank you. Yeah, I'll beat you this time. No matter how hard you try, you'll never beat me. Let's do it. Evil spirit something, because I couldn't read it, because he was too quick. Anyway, we gotta do all whoop! Okay, let's do this game. We got this. Yeah. No! Father poop! Ugh, freaking okays. Not okay. Okays, not okay. Also, you know, for a, ch for a chubby kid, he can, uh... He can definitely, uh, jump, to say the least. Also, yeah, Toen, uh, you, you, you never fail, Toen. I, uh, can I, will you, will you marry me, Toen? Because you are just perfect. You complete me. Son, I love you. You'll be through this time, let's do it, you will, oh, we're Peller, that's what he's saying. Oh, it's a dog, whoop! Okay, we can do this, we can do this, we can do this. Yeah, 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 yeah! Yeah, all cools. Oh, we are awesome. Excellent. Oh, yeah. Oh, we got another opal. Okay. Well, eh. I guess it wasn't really that worth it. But you know what? No, no. You know what? That was totally worth it. Say, so, you, uh, you're kind of strong. Uh, Harumph. And he just. God. How? Physics. 
gravity, they are a thing, but apparently not for him. Look, I'm not on my lungs, man. my stomach's killing me, that's why I'm better, see you then. I am so enthusiastic to read him. And hey, I'm only seeing this one, so you better listen. My name is... But. Okay, no, it's not. It is Goro. <sighs> Goro. Thank you for that. Tell me, I just ah, oh, can everybody just today is officially National Appreciate Toen's Face Day. Just thank you, Mr. Man, for all you do, for all you contribute to this just wonderful, wonderful experience. I truly appreciate you. Also, we just picked up an item called none other than the Hunter's Earring. Very cool. Alright, so anyway. Atataki Village. Who is? Alright, so just like Nurum Village, this is going to be our next uh, Geo... Geo... Um, yeah, Georama. I think I almost called it... Okay, um, well, <laughs> I was just, uh, just, just greeted by our neighbor who gave us a bunch of cherry tomatoes and a zucchini. Uh, I'm confused, <laughs> to say the least. Anyway, though, I don't even know what I was saying because I was so interrupted, but, uh, essentially this is the next Giorama, uh, place that we have to go to, so, uh, keep in mind these rivers. They ain't connected, and that may or may not be an issue. But for now, let's just head into this uh, strange looking den. It's America's Diner, Denny's. Trian, in its current state, is helpless without water. Trian is a tree fairy who controls the water element. Without water, it seems like speaking is difficult for it. Toen, you on your own must connect the river that was cut off here at Matataki Village to revive Trian. Trian will then surely aid you in your quest. This is a village which I saved with Atla. The village could be revived if the Atla can be found. The Atla are probably scattered around the Wise Owl Forest. You can enter the forest by opening Matataki's gate here. I will open the gate for you. Go and see what you can find. Listen, Toen, make the river your priority. Connect the river to save Triant. Got it? So yeah, that's essentially what I was saying about the river. So, bada boom! Yes. Alright, so, uh, I don't know about you guys, but, uh, not sure I'm really liking the look of this guy. I don't know if I really want him to be arrived, if you know what I am saying. But we gotta do it. We gotta do it. So for now, we're gonna make our way back to Marataki Village. Delicious Sushi Village. And... Where is it that I'm looking for? Where is it that I'm looking for? I'm leave this is the gates, or is it? I don't know. Hold on, let me get my bearings. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I think, wait, I think that's where we come in from? Oh wait, and that's where we go to see Goro, aha! Here it is. Let's do this. Wise Owl Forest, the second dungeon in this dang fangled game. Alright, so uh, going to Territory 1, not B1. We're not playing Battleship anymore. We are. Uh, uh, I was gonna say Monopoly, but I really don't think that fits. If it was Property 1, there we go. I'd be uh, in the clear zone. But, starting off, we're gonna be greeted with some new enemies uh, Wednesday. Named after the state. No less. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but now you do know. Uh, they can get pretty annoying. So, Exao's gonna be like our 
best bet for actually a lot of the enemies in this place. Not all of them, mind you. Not all of them, but uh, a lot of them. <laughs> to say the least. So, you know, I, I guess I used uh, Exao a lot when I went um, through the last part of Divine Beast Cave, so we'll, we'll go ahead and give Toen a little more screen time. Not too much, though, because he is not quite as beautiful. His face, his face is pretty good. His, his face is pretty pristine, to say the least. But everything else, eh, I think Toen still kind of beats him. But, uh, anyway, I love this dungeon theme. Like, seriously, give this poop a ch or check this poop out, is what I'm trying to say. Words. Anyway, though, uh, one thing that is- oh, wow, two fountains in a row. One really sick and annoying thing about the, uh, the imps that are named after days of the week is that all of them have the chance to steal your money. And no matter what, if they do steal your money, if you defeat them, you get part of it back, but you still permanently lose a good chunk, like, I think maybe, maybe 50 or so gold? Which, you know, if, if they hit you repeatedly, like, like, you know, it starts to add up. But anyway, ooh, windmill slash, are you guys ready? Let's do this. Thursday, Thursday, stop. Oh, God, God stop it, mother, God dang it, so, see, oh, Lord, what? Get out of here! I hate these things so much. I just want to use windmill slash. Nope. Okay, that's that's it. Last draw. Oh, get away! God, mother! Ugh, get out of my life, mother! No, no, not today. Holy crap! How many? How many were there in a row? Three. That was our redonk donkulus. Yo, my name is Nicholas, and this is ridiculous. Got mad gun money, and it is deliciousness. <laughs> I had to quote it. I had to quote it for all those people who have had Vine for at least like a month and a half or so. You know what I'm talking about. You feel me. Actually, well, I kind of hope you don't, actually. Okay, Wimble Slash. Let's do this. Yeah. Oh, Lord. Get out of here. Okay, I'm just going to spam our combo and see. Oh, crap. Come on! Friday is probably one of the easier ones to deal with, so I'm I'm okay with fighting Fridays, but man, Thursdays. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. All right, uh, we're gonna take these undead things out. Oh wow, we are uh, running a little out of room for attachments, but that's okay because do I have a secret for you? And by secret, I mean surprise. We're gonna go ahead. I'm gonna be a little bit lazy. Use one of our power-up powders and officially get the Gladius up to plus five. Do you know what that means? It is status break time. Seal 60% weapon ability to sphere. Oh lordy, lord lord lorderson, am I excited. Oh yes, oh yes. Alright, so uh, just to show off how powerful this thing is going to be now. Let's put on the sex, shall we? But boom look at that! Look how much that increases our stuff. Holy crap. Holy poop. Holy yes. Actually, holy, because it gives us holy. Yes, I'm excited about this. Okay, so, uh, let me see. Do we... Okay, so we need attack, endurance, speed, magic. Okay, so that would be good for that. Uh, we also need ice, wind, holy. Okay, again, good for that. Alright, we don't need any undead, but you know what? I don't care. I am going to use the Gladius plus five for Tone's sacks. For his, well, for pot, I mean, uh, you can always, always improve your sacks, if you know what I'm talking about. Also, I forgot, all right, we need sage and metal. I believe we have sage. We do, we have two, in fact. Um, let's go ahead and put the wind. Yeah. Okay, that looks, that looks pretty good. I'm okay with this. Oh, how much, what, what element does opal do? doesn't do anything okay yeah we'll go ahead and do the wind for now okay and then we might let's give uh Xiao, instead of the attack plus one let's give her another opal all right and let's see uh we're going for the top half of her okay yeah yeah yes. all right because the opal gives yeah another uh 10 to metal which is gonna be very useful so i'm okay with this also wait oh we're equipping the dagger that is not okay. Let's go ahead. Bada boom, bada bing. Now we can officially use the sacks without feeling guilty. Also, 
Okay, let's just... Oh, Wednesday... Yeah, okay, Wednesdays are pretty good, too. Um, I, I'm okay with Wednesday and Friday. Nice! Just the two days of the week I really just don't mind seeing right now. Now, you maybe think to yourself, wait, wait a sec. Did you just pick up two different gate keys? Uh, well, to answer, why yes. Yes, I did. Let me, uh, let me lay down some informaciones on you guys. There are actually three gate keys for every floor of this dungeon. Yeah. Each one is completely random. There's really, there's absolutely no way to predict it. So, your best bet. I see you there. Under things. Sh uh, tumbling. Wanna say, love your hair. Here I go. Mumbling. With my freeze ray, I will stop the pain. Okay, sorry, sorry, Dr. Horrible, I just gotta quote it at least once. Anyway, though, there is the uh, pointy chestnut, the, uh, I believe it's the red berry, and the shiny stone. Typically, I just like to, you know, get all three and then just pick and choose whatever when we get up to the uh, exit, and you'll, you'll, you'll see what the exit is. Also, dang it, I'll meet you at that room that we haven't gotten to yet. Here we go, kicking butt and taking names, what's new? Friday, holy crap. Dude, why are you moving so fast? Jeez, just calm down. Ah, uh, Wednesdays. Oh wait, no, no, I, I'm okay with Wednesdays, okay. It's all good, it's all good, I'm sorry, I forgot my preferences in days. Also, <gasps> ooh, what we gonna get, what we gonna get? Let's choose the small box. Ooh, a topaz! Nice! It's a another gem that is really stinking good as an attachment. I'm okay with this. Uh, actually, you know what? Uh, let me go ahead and show off what topazes do uh, real quick-like. Alright, so, uh, topaz. I believe they increase... Okay, here, let's take Rock Breaker off real quick. Okay. I believe they... Yeah, they do uh, attack and speed, so plus 5 attack, plus 10 speed. Okay, so no attributes, but then they also do... Ooh, 10 undead and 10 flying. Alright, so I really just need to remember- okay, repair. I really just need to remember uh, what I want- or what uh, the slingshot needs. Okay, so it doesn't need that, so for now we're not gonna give uh, Ixao the topaz, but what about Toen? Nope, not really, so we're gonna hold off using the topaz for now. But anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and meet you guys at the exit. And we made it! And yes, that is an owl with a mustache. My question to you is why not? Because I know you're asking yourself why. I just, I can feel, I can feel the questioning. All right, so let's try the red berry. Okay, so he's not in the mood for the red berry. Let's try the, the shiny stone. Not in the mood for the shiny stone, of course. So. It looks like we're gonna have to use the uh, pointy chestnut in order to get pet. What? Uh, what? Uh, what? Please tell me I'm not alone in him bewildering me with his mustache. Ooh, what? Ooh, this game is so Japanese. Anyway, that's gonna be it for today. Thanks for watching me play. I'm so glad we got through another little section of story uh, having to do with tree ants, Goro, and we got to uh, tackle a uh, floor o oh, the wise owl forest. Bada boom, bada bing. I will see you guys next time for when we take on even more. Toen, do you have anything left to say? Nope. That's what I thought. <laughs>